Hi, Kyoji here. I'm here for I use Hoshi. Now this uh this dropped like four days ago. But uh you know the the one with the uh V, the win the love wins all, I think that's what it was. Man, that was so cinematic and beautifully done, well acted. You know, it was awesome with the cube flying around. Anyway, <clears throat> this one looks also very cinematic. It's something or someone is flying, I guess, and through the beautiful sky with the clouds and everything. Let's see what's up. Oh, one second. That wasn't very smart, was it? <laughs> Forgot to plug my uh, headphone. Ooh, that does look like sport. Okay, the visuals, the visuals, the song, I think it's good, but I, I'm just, uh, the visuals are so interesting, man. First of all, her, her style is just totally different. Uh, she's like, she's tripping, man. <laughs> uh, Korea is very strict, strict, strict against the, uh, any form of, um, uh, um, uh, drugs but looks like somebody's tripping on shrooms uh yeah for you for those who are not versed in drugs shrooms are uh you know it's one of the most famous ones that uh elicit hallucination and uh yeah the, the colors and what I, and i what i also thought was really interesting is the uh the biological term the correct term for horseshoe means the uh, spores but here it's more like a uh, like a seed but where horseshoe is used most like when someone korean when they hear the word horseshoe they always think about mindele horseshoe you know dandelion you know you know how it flies away very fluffy uh, I think that's how it's being used here rather than like, you know, the spore thing. Um, so, hmm. The song is really, uh, it's like, uh, it is consistent with some of her, her, her style, some, some of her songs style. Yeah, that, that's a little funky and uh, playful. But, uh, man, that visuals. Met, you know, you'll be tripping with the uh, people just, you know, that that's a that's a weird uh, weird effect. Can <laughs> you 
<laughs> Look at the trippy people, man. Uh, the vocal backups uh, that she's, I think she's doing it uh, herself, is beautifully done. It's just freaking awesomely done. It's just like if you listen to it, uh, doesn't it feel like you're flying or it is uh, almost, uh, I don't know, peaceful? There's something about that uh, backup vocals. Um, and I think she was almost like rapping. Uh, the visuals is like uh, Kippy plus Dandelion seats. That's what this is. Tripping at the same time. Holy. This is, this is fun. <laughs> So that's a balloon or kite type of a thing. Let's see. Producer IU John Lee. Executive producer. This is creative as hell. Choreograph. Adam. Well. Okay. I mean, okay, overall, uh, I think it's filmed in US somewhere, looks like. Uh, the thing is, man, it's just, uh, she looks vision. I mean, she's blonde here, and she looks beautiful. Uh, she, it, I didn't think this will suit her as well, but it, she looks great. Um, and the concept, um, I think it's about like being free and just letting yourself go and, you know, that the feel of freedom, you know, just uh, like flying through the air, floating, you know, and just going with the wind type of a thing. And, uh, it's just beautifully done, man. Um. The singing, like I said, the back of vocals, her vocals, she tried a lot of new things uh, that have rapping type of a thing mixed in was really cool. Um, yeah, it's just, it just one of those funky, cool kind of song. And just the whole concept and everything, it, this, is, this is a standout, man. It, this is awesome. I mean, her her last one was great too, but wow! It, it, no, it just uh, it was so interesting to watch. Hmm. And just uh, the song and the visuals and everything else, it just delivered uh, what it was shooting for. You know, it's just ten out of ten. Um, wow. And, uh, it just, I, I guess, so some people might think this is, she doesn't look right or she looks just too different or 
the song or whatever but uh i don't think so man this is uh i used to come in the truth the truth is when i first saw ayo you, you know in a in little drama or something and she was a little short fat kid or whatever well, she wasn't but you know but the whole thing and i thought she was a uh, yeah, decent girl you know good idol you know solo but ooh, she she surprised me with her solos uh her songs uh, and her her range uh her deceptively good technique and all that and i thought ooh, well she's a whole lot better than she's not she's more than a cute face because she was getting to be really popular and then, and then the songs themselves, you know, they're a lot more interesting. It's just, uh, she seems to be constantly evolving and, and, and her acting too. I mean, she started out as, you know, what you would think, you know, teenage idol, you know, cute girl concept or student concept, but it just grew. It just kept on and on and on. And it just, she seemed to like do leaps and bounds and just uh become very artistic just she seemed to be you know leveling up and like every time i see her and here um i i, I think uh the last video too I mean, she seemed to be just evolving uh another step and this was really interesting for me as you guys can tell oh this was awesome all right anyway uh thank you very much um yeah well koreans can get high so i i think this is gonna be uh as close as you can get to it we'll get drunk See, that's why koreans drink so much it's a joke guys anyway thank you very much uh this was a wonderful video and i'll see you guys next time bye bye